Let's learn about constellations. Hello, my name is Miss Reed, and together we are going to learn about constellations. If you go outside on a clear night, you can't help but gaze up at the stars. From the beginning of time, people all over the world have cherished the night sky's amazing beauty and mystery. The stars are the oldest things you can think of. Some stars are more than a billion years old. Did you know that the patterns and shapes made by these bright stars tell stories? In fact, the night sky is our oldest picture book. Ancient people, including First Nations, Chinese, Romans, Greeks, Indians, and Babylonians, identified groups of stars called constellations. The most famous constellation legends came from the Greeks and Egyptians. There were 48 constellations identified during ancient times by the Greek astronomer Ptolemy. These constellations were believed to represent figures of heroes, heroines, animals, and creatures in unusual shapes. Here is a picture of one of the most famous constellations, the Big Dipper. If you look closely, you can see a teacup or saucer pan. And if you've heard of the Big Dipper, you've probably also heard of the Little Dipper. Today we're going to look at two of my favorite constellations, Ursa Major and Ursa Minor, also known as the Big Bear and the Little Bear. The story of Ursa Major and Ursa Minor. Zeus was the king of all the gods. He led a very exciting life. One day as Zeus was walking through a wooded area, he came upon a young huntress, Callisto. He thought she was very beautiful. Zeus's wife, Hera, was jealous and used her powers to turn Callisto into a big bear. As a bear, Callisto had a hard life. She missed her son, Arcus. One day, while young Arcus was hunting, he aimed his arrow at Callisto, not realizing that the bear was his mother. Luckily, Zeus was passing by at the moment and jumped between Arcus and Callisto. Zeus told Arcus to put down his bow. Then he changed him into a little bear to keep mother and son together and out of harm's way, Zeus threw the two bears into the night sky. They became the constellations Ursa Major and Ursa Minor, also called the Big Bear and the Little Bear. But how did those bears get those long tails? According to legend, the mighty Zeus stretched their tails as he tossed them into the night sky. The bears' tails form the handle of the Big Dipper and the Little Dipper, which are the famous star patterns inside Ursa Major and Ursa Minor that we looked at earlier. I hope you enjoyed the story of Ursa Major and Ursa Minor, as well as learning about constellations. Thanks for watching!